A Chillicothe restaurant is closing up shop. Cedar House's owners posted on Facebook that they're giving up the restaurant to focus on their other projects. They also own Nat's Place next door, and if you have a Cedar House gift card, you can take it there for a refund. It's possible the restaurant could come back if someone's willing to buy it. And speaking of infrastructure, more road construction begins tomorrow along Dirksen Parkway in Peoria, making travel to the Wayne A. Downing International Airport a bit of a challenge. Crews will be working on completely rebuilding the roadway with new pavement, storm sewers, lighting, and sidewalks leading to Airport Road. The street will be closed in part or in whole through December, weather permitting. Be on the lookout for temporary restrictions, signs, and alternate routes. A popular Chinese buffet in Pekin caught fire this afternoon, though the damage was thankfully minimal. Pekin fire crews were called to Mings of Pekin around 3 p.m. today for a fire that was focused in the kitchen. Crews didn't take long to put out that blaze, which they say started as a grease or cooking fire. No one was injured, and fire officials say the damage was minimal. The restaurant will likely be closed for a few days during cleanup and inspection. I'm on Interstate 55, about 10 minutes outside Lincoln. Around 2.30 p.m., a small single-engine plane uh, had an emergency landing here on the highway. I'm going to step out of the frame and show you the scene right now where they are currently towing the plane. While landing, police say the plane collided with a car on the highway in the northbound lanes. We looked up the plane's registration number and found the plane is owned by Lincoln-based Kilo Aviation. As you can see right now, they are still towing it. We believe they're going to move it off the highway in a matter of moments, but we're still waiting for that to happen. State Trooper Sean Ramsey just told us the vehicle and the plane had minor damages and there are no injuries. Actually, I'm sorry, we only know that there's no injuries to the pilot. We're unsure about other people involved in the accident. The pilot is also from the state of Indiana. We're still unsure exactly what led to the plane landing here and how the crash actually happened. We'll bring you more updates on this story. Right now, I'm live in Lincoln County. Andy Weber, Heart of Illinois, ABC.